Hello everybody, today we are going to be setting up this GE Sync Direct Connect Smart Bulb. So this is a bulb that I already do have set up. However, as you can see, this is a two pack and I'm going to go ahead and set up the second one. I already have had set up the first one, but the second one I'm going to set up today and I'm going to take you guys along with it as well. So this one does support um, Alexa, Google Home, and Matter capabilities right out of the box. Some of them only support these two assistants, but I bought the one that supported Matter in case I wanted to use Matter in the future. You can make any color you want. So, yeah, as you can see, you can put in a lamp, get started with the sync app. I'm going to show you how to do that. And then experience life in sync. You got plenty of products there if you want to check them out. Just at GE Sync. Dot com you can go there and find things or you save yet technologies so you can do a works with the sync app or you can do a you can have a professional connected to to sit to save on to savant so and then of course it works with smart thing since it has matter it works with smart things and apple home as well as obviously alexa and google assistant so alrighty let's go ahead and get started go ahead and power on your bulb it will light up as you can see it's a soft white color and it should start flashing maybe it's not flashing i don't know why i'm gonna go ahead and turn it off and now we are going to GE sync app then we're going to click on add device and lights install your lights okay we already have them installed turn the light on so I'm going to go ahead and turn it on now alrighty it's back on your new smart lights must be turned on to set up make sure they are powered on before connecting look at your devices now we're going to look at your devices and establish a connection it's best to set up them from one room at a time because you have to be 40 feet away for the Bluetooth range. Alrighty, look for the blinking light. Yes, this is mine because it's blinking. Perfect. Set up this device. We are going to name it Party Light. Party Light, and for now, I'm just going to leave it ungrouped. So we're going to connect to Wi Fi. Wi-Fi setup was done off camera for, you know, necessary reasons, but I do, do have my password saved. So if you've used your um, a GE Sync account before and saved your Wi-Fi password, then you can actually just click on your Wi-Fi network and it will go through. So I am actually, I'm just going to put it in the kitchen for now. I think that'll be pretty good. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and... We're going to just go ahead and skip that for now, so... We are having some technical difficulties, so I'm just going to go ahead and try again. And if this doesn't work, then we'll have to troubleshoot the bulb. Factory reset device. Something went wrong. You'll need to factory reset your device to commit it. To find out how to factory reset each device, visit the links below. Customer support. Alrighty, so I went through the process to factory reset the bulb, and it did blink three times. So we are good to go. One device. We're going to go ahead and go back and restart the process completely. Alrighty, I'm going to go ahead and do this off camera. Yes, this is the one that's working. So I'm going to go ahead and do this off camera because we already showed it until we get to the part where it is adding to your home. So, alright. We are now connected. As you can see, the party light in the kitchen. So, checking for updates. We're going to see if it has an update.
And I will let you guys know if I can figure out why the bulb needed a factory reset. So, I think it, the communication just stopped for a second, some, somehow, somewhere. But... Or it could have been that it needed an update. So that it that does happen sometimes. Or if it needs an update, it will have a false connection. So Alrighty, setup complete. We are gonna click done. Because we don't need to add any more devices. And so now in the kitchen. So if we click on it, as you can see, we have the kitchen light strip, which is currently off. You turn that on. It'll do. Let's see what scene that's on. Okay, that's on one of my custom scenes. Anyway, so we're going to go ahead and turn that off. And as you can see, now we have the party light as added into the group. So we can go in. And yes, it is changing in person. I am going Alrighty, here is the bulb as you can see. Alexa. Set party light to blue. Alrighty, perfect. Alexa. Set party light to hyper rainbow. Alrighty. Here it is. Alrighty, so I hope this video helped you set up your GE Sync Direct Connect Smart Bulb. So, alrighty, if you'd like tech like me, consider subscribing, and you do be sure to check out more videos, and give this video a big thumbs up. Thank you guys again for watching.